Hello and welcome back to Let's Play XCOM Enemy Unknown. Okay, sorry I had to check the recording there. Now, the last time we left, uh, we've done a lot of things. We're close to the end game. We were building the Gallop Chamber. Yep. And we were about to proceed to a UFO landing of an abductor with a crew size of 15 whose objective is to harvest live specimens. Everybody is on board, Ethereals, Muton Elites and we were about to send our group with a couple of uh, a couple of side soldiers on board. We were still waiting for the results to come back for a couple of force. Who, who, who is in the thing? Colonel Harry Brown and Charlie Hall. So once that's once that's done, we will have to pick a volunteer to use the gallop chamber and then proceed to the end game. Now the volunteer will be the guy who will save the world. Long story short. So anyway, let's carry on and take this time to level up the psi abilities of our existing psi soldiers. Prepare for deployment, strike one. The drop site for this operation will be in Canada. Canada. Roger that big sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme caution. Current enemy status at the site is unknown. Okay. Let's get, let's get our snipers into position. Uh, we won't be able to... about to say we won't be able to level up uh, Kagdas's abilities that much because well obviously she has problems uh, getting into range of Psy attacks Nicholas is our resident Psy expert hmm didn't I give him ghost armor did I give him ghost armor Shit. No, I did. Okay, anyway. Met day. Okay. Jack Pollard needs to use his. I always thought that was. I always thought that was the zombie sound, but uh, looks like it could be chrysalids. When they're not screaming. Hello. Okay. Bad day. Jack. What should we do with you guys? Uh, how about you? Let's move you up. Oh, Sun Inspiration has no cooldown? Oh, that's cool. 100% to hit. Let's deal with this guy. Indeed it is. Let's give everybody a full dose of mind spray. You can't <laughs> you can't have squad side for mind fray, so anyway. Let's see, who else with psi abilities? I tell you what, I'm 
gonna bring her down. Uh, yep. Touchdown. Still? Cannot too far away? Ah, oh, damn, okay. No, you need to kill somebody. Finish him. All of them don't need experience anymore, so let's just finish him. Finish them off. Now let's see if we can suppress him. No, we have to suppress him for two turns. Because mine free takes two turns to cool down. Alright, let's just finish him. Maybe we can capture him. <laughs> Clear to engage. Ah oh, shit. This is inconvenient. They're flanking my position. And we are flanked. Wow. Okay. Looks like someone's gonna die. That was stupid. <laughs> oh dear. They're starting to lose ground. Oh. <laughs> no, you have don't kill him, please. I believe Ghost Armor helps a lot. Why didn't they shoot me? Okay, idiots. The CPU is dumb. The CPU always ends with blood call. They should be blood calling first, then attacking. Anyway. Here the guns explode, never knew that. Hmm. Let's see if we can bring you down. I know it's a waste of fuel, but nah. Okay, I don't think you can see anybody here though. Can you? Give it a try. Nope. You're blind. Tell what? Let's kill the muton here, and we will keep him as a punching bag for mine's fray. Right? I don't think you can mind free this guy. Okay, this is annoying. Hmm. First order of business, take out the... Uh, the chrysalids
Oh shit. That was my fault. That was my fault. <sighs> wow, grenade, really? Kill him. Okay, I have no idea why it does that, but uh, whenever he dashes for it lags, but anyway, you will die. Oh, 43% to hit. Doesn't need to kill, right? Let's do mind free and get him. That's uh, not gonna help. Screaming. Because you're dead. Okay, let's stabilize Mad Day. Damage, bloody hell. You can't overwatch with double tap. Okay, everybody reload. what happens when you become complacent and we don't have overwatch at all. That is why you don't reload everybody at once. Anyway. Let's take him out. Nice. One more? Okay. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. There should be four left. There might be one ethereal. Hmm. Oh, one, two, three. So we had uh, one, two, three because two drones and a cyber disk. Four, five, six because of the three chrysalids. Seven, eight, nine because of the three neutron elites. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 10, 11, 12 for the 2 mutons and berserkers so we should have 3 left 
one of which should be the uh, what you call it, ethereal. Or are there two ethereals in this map? Can't remember. Anyway, we have three enemies left. Ah, one ethereal and two muton elites because that's usually his uh, honor guard, so to speak. Guard of honor. Yep. Those are the last three. That's the sound of the ethereal. Okay, let's bring our snipers up. We're green to go. Rock and Rock and loaded. Jordan, you can come down now. Roger that. Scanning. <laughs> what was that? Okay, let's proceed. Let's proceed forward. Some breakage in the audio there. Be able to What's build that noise? Uh, our fire stops after this. Assault. So they'll stand in front of the doors. Will you move up? What's making that noise? Come, oh, get into position. Hopefully they're on this level. It'll make it a lot easier on us. This is unlike anything else we've previously identified. Based on its physical appearance, I would assume this alien doesn't rely on brute strength. I recommend the troops exercise extreme caution, Commander. I think I liked it better when the weapons were obvious. Hmm. Ethereal is very powerful. Sometimes they reflect projectiles, which is not doing now. Fantastic. Should we capture him? Uh. This one is dancing. What the hell is going? What the hell is up with him? Yep, and that's why you should not stay near him. Now, oh, let's use our snipers. Oh, you can't see anything. Uh, got mine free. Hundred percent. Okay, let's do it. 
Only forty percent. That is why I put him there, but uh, it didn't seem to work out. Oh, he runs. Who else? Kagdas, time for you to do mind free. First, I want you to absorb the Overwatch. Like the spoof criminal <laughs> uh, music video. You know the part where they bend? Oh, you can't. Why? Damn it. Ah. Let's just finish him. Drop. Okay, not too much. 77. But uh, otherwise she would have been, what, 90... 92? Damn it. Anyway, mind control. So we have a... Uh, okay, she's not weak, but a relatively okay mind controller, I guess. Alright. Jack Polat's doing very well. And I believe we can build... Our... Two UF uh, firestorms, three UF firestorms now. Not enough hangar base. Why? Oh, one is under really on construction. All right, let's just build another one. I prefer to build them in pairs, but uh, what the hell? Let's not waste six days. What was that? One more flag, uh, one more. Wow, check this out. <laughs> we can build one more uh, firestorm. One ethereal corpse. All research is done, right? Yeah, no active research. Let's carry on. Advanced flight. No, I don't need money now. I can donate if you want. Firestorm complete. Let's have it transferred. Who's the third continent? Europe? Yeah. And let's build the next Firestorm. Not required, but, you know, just to make everything nice. Let's carry on. Harry Brown okay so that's it then folks we have all uh, we have well, we have three heavies that are high in will actually that's it folks we can pretty much uh, proceed with end game oh not yet the gallop chamber is still f off okay let's carry on then This is it. So, basically, all we need to contain uh, so basically, all we need to contain. The uh, 
the uh, psychic, psionic emanations or whatever dangers they were expecting from this thing is loss of water and uh, yeah that looks like it okay maybe maybe these four pillars have some protective capabilities but you know it's just water even the roof is not filled in it's still filled with you know it's still uh, earth soil and uh it's clear that the alien device will not respond to attempts at physical interaction however if we can find a soldier with strong enough psionic abilities, we may be able to activate it. Basically, we just give any one of our Psy soldiers the Psy armor and they can use it, but... Uh, increase our soldier's psionic strength. Oh, as it use the armor, huh? So... Who shall we bring? Who shall we choose to save the day? Hmm? Because we don't have to wait any longer. Let's just finish the hangar. Uh, someone got transferred, right? Demon 3, where are you? Yeah, plasma cannon. No, no, no. So you are dismissed. So who shall we use? Who wants to save the world? You know, we could have a ruffle. <laughs> hmm. Matt Day, Harry Brown, Jack Pollard, Nicholas Hassan, Kakdas Pollard. Pollard and Pollard. Tell you what, we will end this stream here. Uh, I need to figure out a way to decide who is going to. Maybe we can just we'll just do it randomly, and we'll have the, or we'll like somehow have them pick virtual straws or something. So while well, I decide that, uh, I'll see you next episode. Remember to like and subscribe. You can support this channel by using the links below to save on your next game or game points purchase, and. I'll see you again soon. Thank you very much. Bye-bye.